Okay, I really am gonna use it. <laughs> All right, welcome to a product review. So I've been waiting for this for a while. So this is a uh, disc brake cover. What is that? Do I really need it? Eh, technically no. You could just take off the rims and tires or yeah, just take them off. But anyways, this is what it is. See no cover, cover. So basically put it on, put your chain cleaner on, make sure you don't contaminate your rotors. Um, so I've been really careful with my stuff, but I kind of, you know, a little scared. So I got these, um, they're 29 bucks on Amazon right now. I'll put a link in there, but I'll show you what it looks like when, it, when I open this up. But let me see what it says down here. Protects rotors from lube and protection overspray. I got a lot of overspray, but today I'm gonna actually wash my bike. So I'm finally gonna open this bad boy up. All right, so we have our pads here. Let's see how they work. We're about to give it a nice little wash. Don't make fun of me. I just moved into my house and we haven't done anything yet. Well, we got a pool coming, so anyways. All right, here we are here. Wha Wha I really didn't think it through. Cause uh, who knew? Cause <laughs> it was gonna be an issue. So uh, they're actually Velcro. You un, I guess split them apart, then put the back side in there, and then we'll add the front side. We'll see how that works out. I thought it would just slip on, but apparently it doesn't make sense. <laughs> All right, here we go. That's what it looks like. Took a little bit to set up, but you know, it kind of reminds me of the whole motocross when we used to put those uh, those disc uh, protectors on there. There's the back. Um, I guess I should flip it around because the drivetrain's <laughs> on the other side. <laughs> but I just did it this way for the video. Actually, kind of cool. All right, so I used the muck off uh, drivetrain cleaner. Um, I guess I can go balls out now because i don't have to worry about the spray over spraying into the disc but you never know but anyways um spray this down i should have probably brought my brush but good spray down see this chain was actually really clean it's my road bike it's really dirty so i have to play with that one might be enough on there probably get a little scrubby in there I usually scrub it down with this. So that's why you get a clean drivetrain. If I'm not doing it right, just let me know. But uh, <laughs> what I've been doing for the last year and a half with this. Um, I got this whole clean set um, as a package. I guess I'll drop a link in there. But um, driving clean drivetrain is a fast drivetrain, right? Fast bike. Got to get in there, scrub a little bit more. I have another tool that I'll use right now on that. Little cogs. I might as well just give you the whole gamut of what I do. So, you know what? Never mind. I got a video on this already. So, I will, I guess I'll put the link in there. But anyways, I'll show you what I do. All right. After using it on both bikes, is this a product you should buy? I don't know. It's, it's okay. Um, I already bought it, so I'm going to use it. Um, it was really cool. I didn't actually have to be really careful around uh, my rotors. So that was super cool. They were actually dry, except for the part here that had a little water that goes through, but I wasn't spraying on that side anyway. So um, yeah, it worked out pretty good for me. So, all right, that's it. That's my review and uh, hopefully you guys get it. If you don't, let me know. But anyways, I thought they were a pretty cool idea.